We stopped at the Round Barn to uh, to take a look and uh, and see what that was all about. At the time we visited, they were actually re-roofing a section of it, and that was kind of interesting seeing them uh, nailing the wood shake on the uh, the thing because it's I mean it's 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 quite a piece of work. I mean the thing is. Uh, you know, it's handmade. There was no, uh, there was no order up a round barn kit back in 1898 when it was built. It's, uh, it's, a, it's completely original. Hey, what's your name? Yeah, I understand you know a lot about this round barn. Oh, yes, sir, I sure do. What's I'm, your name? I'm Mr. Sam. Everybody in this country knows Mr. Sam around here. Oh, okay. All right, now, uh, you know, Daddy had a farm just right down there on the river. Oh, okay. Uh, you know, almost growing up years, and I, that's where I lived. Mr. Sam full of energy, couldn't keep up with Mr. Sam. He'd either just uh, finished an espresso or, or is just like the most uh, energetic uh, octogenarian I've ever met. And then uh, three, uh, three years, no, uh, about 60 years ago, I bought my Great Ants farm, which is three miles east, oh, okay. uh, right down the road, the prettiest farm in this part of the country. He was something to watch. Um, you could just feed off Mr. Sam's energy. But anyway, I've uh, I've laid out here, and I know all the stories about the barn and right, all this country. Right. And uh, I got it, I, I, when people come into the barn, well, well, they'll uh, uh, I'll start right here, and I'll go all the way around and telling stories, and they love to hear those sure. stories. Sure. Well, really how old like, is this barn? When was it built? Oh my goodness, it was built uh, back in the late 1897. Okay. Uh, I'm sorry, 98. And uh, it was built by Mr. Oder and. Uh, uh, what's what's so strange about it, it he built this great big barn right out in the middle of 320 acre farm and there was no highway no railroad no town no nothing and he really? built this beautiful big barn if uh, the upstairs he built it for loose hay and um, okay. see, that was before the before we had hay bailers and so that's why it's so big up there oh, but, okay but there's no way in this world when you get up there you'll see why that they can't fill that thing full of hay it's just it goes up to 43 feet up there at the point up there. Wow. And it's a monster of a room. He uh, was uh, more than happy to show us around and give us some history of the of the barn. And and I, I loved his story about one of the reasons that they made round barns was so that the evil spirits couldn't hide in the corners. I'd never heard that one before. Up in the up in Pennsylvania, up in Massachusetts, they yeah. were very superstitious back in the early days. Oh. And so and so the people that built the round barns, they the farmers, they were afraid the devil was going to catch him if they caught him up there uh, working up in the in the loft up there and in a, in a square cornered barn like that, they would catch him in the corner. Corner. And so now if they built a round <laughs> barn, they you they go around and around and around, around, around and you no corner. He never would catch you. Okay. And so that's why they. Built. I never heard that. That's no, interesting. No. You didn't just make that up, did you? No, 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 no. That's, Sam's telling the truth. He says. Okay, true. okay. Now, I still kind of wonder if he didn't make that up. <laughs> now, Mr. Older didn't. Uh, the man that built this barn, he didn't do that. Now he built it because Oklahoma has always been known as what? Tornado Alley. Tornado Alley. Okay. Now, even back in the 1800s, uh, we had tornadoes here in Oklahoma. Sure. And so he said, instead of building a square barn where the wind could hit that flat side and knock it down, Put no guess sides what? On. Look at here. Look here, wow. the wind will go roll this way and sure, this way. Sure. I have stood right here. The sure. wind, the wind it's blowing. aerodynamic. Yeah, the wind blowing 70 miles an hour. And you couldn't even stand up out here. I go inside, you don't even know the wind's blowing. No creaking. Wow. And so uh, that's why he built the round bar. He did a fantastic job on doing that. Fun to talk to. He was a neat, he was a neat guy. I, I only pray that I'm half that energetic when I'm that age. Well, no, Sam, I appreciate it. Very okay, informative. Sure, sure it was nice to meet you. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna to take you. a walk around here. And, okay. And okay, uh, guys. see a little bit more of it. It's a pleasure yeah. to meet you. Okay. Thank you. The Round Barn in Arcadia, folks. Don't miss it.